Good evening, everyone. My name's Heath Haskins, Code Primate, and welcome back to another Lumber Tycoon 2, where um, I'm doing VR tonight, and I've just jumped into a random server. I think somebody jumped down there on my face a second ago. I could have sworn I saw somebody. Maybe not. Um, but I did notice that my um, headsets and my hair, like, I've got some restrictions going on here. So let's reset. Oh, why? Now it's going to drop my axe way down there, but I should have my headphones. Here we go. That's what I was looking for. Alright, where'd my axe go? Here it is. So uh, there's some new features in Oaklands that I'm loving where the VR um, hands are actually interactive and stuff. But, uh, that's not what we're here for tonight. We're here to do a little bit of hunting. We're going to go hunt for Spookwood in... Uh-oh, hold on. Button, button. In Lumber Tycoon 2 in VR. This is going to be awesome. Uh, lights. Get, it, get out of the car. There you go. I noticed that if I slightly touch the controller, it automatically like pushes in that direction. So. Alright, let's go hunting for some spook woods. It's nighttime, so we can't see around very far, but we can drive through here. Uh, oh, and just so you know, this is the second time I've tried recording this. The first time uh, it looked like that the uh, microphone had not turned on, and there was a bug of some kind. So I released a video yesterday um, on Oaklands that had the, kind of the same thing. There was like a bug. Come on, buddy. Come on. Talk to me. Talk to me. Oh. Ah. There we go. Did he lower it? Oh, he's lowering it. So smooth, too. Look at that. Look how smooth it's coming down. Like a smooth operator. Smooth operator. Oh, uh, hi, buddy. Oh, it's a race. It's a race, and I'm going to win. I'm going to win it. Quickly, let's go look for spook. Looking for a spook tree. Not that way. Anything over there? Anything up there? Nothing, nothing, nothing. Oh! <gasps> no way. No way. Ah, uh, it's a dead tree. Dang it. So close. Not even close. Not even in the same realm as a spook tree. Nothing over there. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Should we try and walk up there? I mean, it's been a while since I've come from this side. Oh, oh, oh. Come on. Choppity chop chop, bro. What is this thing? Is this a walnut? Now, I don't know if I can rotate. Can I rotate? Hold on. Quick to grab. Oh yeah, I can rotate. <laughs> All right, so grab with the right. And, ooh. Grab with the right, grab with the right. And then on the left, you're gonna hold trigger. And then you're going to rotate the, uh, well, maybe. Oh, it's not moving at all. Okay, hold on. Kick. There we go. Click, click, rotate. That is weird. But fun. But fun. All right, grab, push, go. There we go. That'll work. Uh, wait. 
Whee! Alright. Well... This is gonna be a long walk. So, how you guys been? I know that you've been wanting to see more lumber. Definitely want more lumber. But I don't know why. It's just lumber? Not as many people have been watching my VR Oakland series. Which I don't really mind. I more or less record for the enjoyment of recording. Not for your approval of recording. But I'm glad that you guys like it. Oh, this is taking forever. Um, how many of you know what raisin pie is? Have you guys ever had raisin pie? I love raisin pie. Now, the original reason for the raisin pie was it's for funerals. It's for a death or for mourning. But, I mean... Oh. <clears throat> I don't know. I really like raisin pie. I asked for one for my birthday. My wife went and found a lady who makes them. You know, it's actually hard to find a place that'll make raisin pies. I don't know if you guys have anything local, like in your village or your town, city, wherever you live. Hey, that's a quick question. How many of you are watching this and you live in a village? Not a town, not a city, but a village. I don't know how many people live in villages anymore. I know lots of people live in suburbs, but that's not really a, a city or a village. No spookwood. Dang it. Alright, well, we'll just keep walking this way. I don't know if you guys are going to like the uh, the VR lumber. I might have to go back to the old school. And a lot of you were saying, Code, we want to see your face. We've always seen your face. Well, uh, that's nice, except you still couldn't see my face. I mean, I could record the Oculus on my head, but it's not really the same. <laughs> Does that make sense? I mean, like I was kind of trying to figure out a way to record and do the face cam at the same time, but this is so much better. Literally, I have my Oculus. That's it. I hit record and it's recording over here. I got my mic set up. It's the perfect volume. Everything is done. All I got to do is take this video when I'm done, upload it to my computer, and then I can post it or edit it if I wanted to. Ugh, the lighting is weird. Oh. I just thought of something. And I don't know if I should do it or not. Tick to twerts. Tick tack twerts memorial. I've never seen it. Like up close and personal in VR like this. Um, yeah, I want to go see it. So this this turned in from a hunting video to I want to go see Tick's um, memorial. And for those of you that don't know, Tick to Twerk, she used to be a Roblox YouTuber and great builder. Um, she passed away. And she passed away because... Well, actually, I don't know if I should say it. There's a lot of a lot of people who know why she passed away, um, but it was medical reasons, and it was quick too. It was so quick. We had heard from her on Friday, and when Monday came around, she was gone. So, anyhow, sorry, I didn't mean to make a sad moment there, but death is something that we need to talk about. I mean, it is part of being a human. It's part of life. So if you don't talk about it, then you're kind of being ignorant towards it and therefore not accepting the physicality, the actuality of life. Death is a thing. 
it happens. We should be fearful of it. It's scary, like, but it's natural. Okay? It's everybody's going to die. Eventually die. Except maybe the, the what is it, the the jellyfish that lives forever. And it doesn't really live forever. It can die too. Come on, respawn. No, not check. Respawn. Ah! There it is. Did it? Did I click it? Oh. Nope. Close. There it goes. Alright. Well, hmm. Maybe I should drop my X, just in case. Ooh. Okay, so that, that ray tracing that I was talking about, it happens off the hand. And the way you can tell is I move the ray into the object and it comes closer. Because it thinks it wants me, to, it, it's trying to touch like the back of the, the thing here. So like, if same thing if I were to do this. Push it against, right? Oh, it's moving. Oh, yeah, it is moving a lot. Wow. Anyhow, um, because of the ray trace, like if I'm down like this and the ray gets broken by the tailgate, the object I'm carrying goes towards me. It, it wants to try and hit that ray trace point, the, the point that it's at. But if I move the ray trace up, it no longer is a problem. Oh, well, not until I pass through the gate. So, that is really cool. I don't know. I don't know what I'm talking about, Cog. Just, just go. Click, grab, click. Ah, there it goes. Oh, wait, I was going to drop this. Drop? Okay. Because I don't want to get stuck. All right, I don't want to lose my axe attempting this. Man, I don't even know if I can do this in VR. Oh, this is going to be crazy. Oh, sorry, buddy. I'm not, I'm not trying to run you off the road. Alright, here we go. Okay, that is darkening. Woo! Not bad. My uh, health up there. Not bad, not bad. We were able to keep a little bit of health for us. Oh man. Look at that. Should I wait for the hell? Yeah, I better. Better wait until it goes all the way up. Otherwise, I might die. By the way, I don't like the health going through the money like that. Default, yeah. Josh, go, go fix that, please. Go fix that. Almost done. A lot of people are saying, Code, are you the developer of Flubber? No, I am not. This is, this is not my game, and I don't want it to be my game. Like, no offense to Defaultio, like, it's his game. Defaultio, Josh, he's the one that did all this. So, woo, here we go. Woo. Oh, there's my favorite sounds from the textures. I wish there were a way to pause, like a way that I could just pause it and take a break for a second, but I can't. Oh, and another thing about the headsets, if you take them off while you're in game, it'll shut you down. It'll shut down your Roblox game. You can't leave or AFK at all. With a computer, I can do that. With these, I cannot. 
slow us back up to health. Here we go. Ready? Three, two, one. over there yet because I don't want to see it. You guys ready? Three, two, one. Oh, that's cool. Okay. For bad reasons. isn't coming through for some reason. Is it just not got enough processing power? Thank you everyone for watching this episode of Lumber Tycoon 2 with me, Heath Haskins, Code Primate. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe down below. Do all those cool things I'm supposed to call out at the end of the videos like a good YouTuber does, but it's your choice. If you want to, go for it. If not, that's cool too. You were here, you watched, you had fun. I love you for that. Have a great night. I will talk to you very soon. Outro.